Yo, what's up? It's your boy Matt from ANMCV. Thank you guys for clicking that play button on this video. Thank you guys for watching. More importantly, be sure to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it. Now, 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 today's video. I had, you know, you know, we all share videos. We all post videos, whether it's on Facebook, Facebook groups, uh, Google Plus, wherever it might be. Now, I hope you're not spamming your videos. You know, you know, share it once a day, something like that. Not spam, 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 spam. Spamming is bad. You eat spam. You don't spam, but you eat spam with bread and cheese. So recently, I did like a little mini poll on sub for sub. Now, I don't knock anybody who does sub for sub. I don't hate anybody who does sub for sub. Sub for sub isn't that bad bad I guess you could say but uh, but I got my own views on it now let me let me give y'all a quick story real quick it's a couple of Facebook groups I'm a part of a couple of them and I share my video once a day you know um that's just kind of how I look how I network outside of YouTube um so I might share a video share a video BAM share a video a second later somebody comes below my comment somebody comes below my video when I post my video and says you know subscribe to your channel done if you don't subscribe to my channel I'm gonna unsubscribe to you I didn't know that's how the world of networking works and sometimes in some cases I have like I might put a, po a post up or whatever in the group and then the, the guy or the girl below it might say uh, they might just throw up their channel link you know I hate that just because when I put post my video don't just throw your channel link at the bottom of my in my comment section and expect me to sub after that no I mean like I said get your money do what you do but let me tell you what I, how I feel about that okay I'm how I feel about it right now I feel like if I post a video up in a group boom post it bam just now you come below in my comment section and you want to post you want to post you like you know I want to share my video with this guy share your video with me but let me know what's up talk to me net communicate with me cuz I, I feel like a lot of folks just copy and paste and copy Copy and paste. Copy and paste. Ching ching. Paste. Copy and paste. See? That's what y'all do. But we don't never engage in conversation other than you want to sub to my channel or sub back. No, I don't want to sub to you, bro. I don't want to sub to your channel. First of all, I don't even know who you are. Second of all, you're like a pedophile. Third of all, click on your name, click on your profile on Facebook. You have no photos, no friends, and, no, and, and you're, you're blocked. The well, one thing I cannot stand is that if it's a girl in a profile picture and I click on the name, whoop. Whoop. Some stuff like that. So I'm getting mad. I click on your page and it's a dude. It's an Arab man or a Hispanic guy or a black guy. Come on. Are you in it for the love and the passion? Or are you just in it for the money? Or you what's up, people? Don't take advantage of the sub for sub in a negative and just in a negative way. I hate that. Like that's why I want to do this video so bad because it's been on my chest. Like it's been on my it's been on my chest, man. So that's, that's you know, I like, sub for sub is cool. Sub for sub is cool, man, but it's just how you use it. From what I've seen people do in Facebook groups, it's disrespected, Dis dis disrespected. I put a video up, bam, you in my comment section two seconds later. Hey, I subscribe, subscribe back. Whoa, wait a minute, did you watch the video? What did you like about the video? What's the name of my video? And they might screenshot, you know, them subscribing and them liking the video and them comment below. Great video, man. Did, you didn't even watch the video. Don't lie to yourself. You didn't watch the video. Stop lying. You did not watch my video. You wanted a quick sub. Get out of here. Get out of here. So basically, I'm, I'm, I gotta go through my phone real quick. I created a quick poll. I created a quick poll in some of the subscribe for subscribe groups. Now, not knocking anybody to subscribe. Now, these are the questions that I, this is what, this is what the post said, right? I'm gonna try to put it up here somewhere. I'm gonna put, put it right here. It says, if you can answer any of these questions below, do so in the comments comment section. Thank you. First question was, what is sub for sub? Second, what are the plans, what are the pros of sub for sub? Third, what are the cons of sub for sub? Fourth, why do you sub for sub? Five, do you think it's right to sub for sub to gain loyal subscribers? Thank you for taking the time to answer these questions. AMTV. I got a couple of responses. Three people responded, but we're going to read three of them and, and we're going to talk about it. This first guy, I don't know his name, whatever, Jamal, Jamal, he said, one, subscribe for subscribe. What is sub for sub? Subscribe for subscribe. Duh. Come on, Two. The question was, what are the pros? Um, you gain subs faster. You gain subs faster. Wow. Let's gain subs faster. That's what we're supposed to do on YouTube, right? That's why we YouTube. That's why we work hard and we grind to gain subs faster. Just to sub, to sub for somebody. That don't even sound right to me. You're supposed to gain those subscribers the right way, the grind way. You got to get all the grind. But if you want to sit here and say sub for sub and not respect the grind, what you work? What you on YouTube for? What are you? What are you, what are you doing? Three, what are the cons? He said, you gain inactive subs faster. Is that you contradicting yourself, bro? You said you gain subs faster and you gain inactive subs faster. What? That's, what? Bro, you're, it, it's contradictory. Like, you're telling yourself you get them faster, but then you get inactive subs faster. 
Anyway, four, the question was, why do you sub for sub? Need subs to join networks. So that's why you sub for sub. You need subs to just join specific. You don't need to sub for sub, just join network. You go out there and you tell people, hey, this is what I do. You, this is what I do. You know, you don't always have to sub. Okay, anyway. Five, do you think it's right to do sub for sub to gain more subscribers? Depends. You should sub for sub depending on your type. Type of what? Type of video? Any type of video? My video is about freaking pillows and chairs. So what's up? God, Lee! Next guy, he just blankly just put a comment and said, It is just a starting boost to new channels. When you have zero subs, it's almost impossible to promote your channel. Now, I agree and I disagree. I agree. It's hard. It's very, very hard to promote your channel. It's hard to go out there and network. It's hard to go out there and say, hey, this is what I do. You know what I'm saying? Here's my video. If you like what you like, feel free to subscribe. You know what I'm saying? It, it, it's hard to do that. It's hard to talk to people. It's hard to do that in social media. There's so many things in social media we can do, but it's so darn hard to talk to somebody and say, hey, this is what I do. Or to promote yourself and say, hey, this is what I do. Or the network say, hey, buddy, so you do YouTube? I do too. This is what I do. It's so hard. I disagree, bro. It's not hard to do that stuff, man. It's not hard to go out and promote your channel. Because if you love doing what you do, it'll be no problem, I say. It'll be no problem. It won't be no problem. If you love doing what you do, whatever this is, if you love doing what you do, it shouldn't be no problem to go out there trying to grind and respect it. I'm gonna really push that because I love doing YouTube, man. I love doing these videos. I love networking and communicating with other people. But, 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 it's no problem for me. In the long run, it'll all be worth it, yo. So, I totally agree with what he's saying, but it's like, yo, you should love doing what you do on this YouTube, man. This is your life, this is what you, you want to give your life to the world. You want to show your, showcase your world, your life to the world. God bless America. You want to showcase your life to the world. It's nearly impossible to get subscribers. I, mean, I had zero subscribers, man. I start, We started in January. This is not sub for subbing. This is because I network. I communicate. I share my videos here and there once a day. That's it. You got, you got to step outside of YouTube world. You got, to, you got to think of something different. It's not, nothing's impossible, bro, bro. Nothing's impossible. What's your name? Gahama Khashibi? Nothing's impossible, dog. Stop doubting yourself. Anyway, God, I, I get so, I get so aggravated. Okay, last one, guys. Okay, I'm back. Sorry, camera died. We're back. Batteries halfway charged. But let's finish this off real quick. So, last one. The guy said, a useful method to gain viewers. Okay. Two, get you a boner and somewhat of status. What? Three, the worst possible way to really grow. Amen, brother. Amen, brother. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. Thank you. Thank you. Um, four, therefore I don't. Thumbs up, brother. Five, no, no. And he also said a high sub count versus a low view count actually sets you back in suggested vid section. Now, that, that, that's, that right there, brother, that's what I'm talking about. Th just don't do it. Don't cheat, listen, man, I tell people all the time, don't cheat yourself out of this grind, out of the YouTube grind. Do not cheat yourself because people will be able to tell, they'll be able to look at you and say, hey, you have 500 and some odd subscribers, but 2,000 views. You have 300 and something subscribers, but 1,000 views. You have 700 subscribers with 2,000 some odd views. No, and as he mentioned, it might cut, cut you out of the suggested section. So don't cheat yourself. Basically sub for sub, it's a win and lose situation. I choose not to do it because you know, I don't want to cheat myself out of the grind, out of the hustle, out of the hard work I put in doing my videos every single day. That's just me. It's me. It's me. I mean, a lot of folks want to say, hey, sub, sub, and blah, 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 blah. I tell them no. They might leave a little comment in the section below. I'm like, no, I don't do sub, sub. Sorry, bro. Find somebody else. So if you put in a comment or a link in my section box, comment section box, after I post my video, I'm not going to reply to you. I'm going to block you. That's going to be it. That's going to be it. I mean, I'm just being real with you. Now, some folks might want to do sub for sub, but not I. Not me. That's not my That's not my way. But that's just how it is, man. And, you know, I don't want to cheat myself out of this grind. I'm not going to cheat myself out of the YouTube grind. Because if you love doing what you do and you put the time and the effort in doing it, you wouldn't need sub for sub. Well, I didn't even know nothing about sub for sub until I started doing sub for sub. Really? Really? So, that's just my quick video on the reasons, the pros and cons of sub for sub. Uh, you know, you guys, let me know how you feel about it in the comment section below. Let me know what you guys think about sub. Do you, do you sub for sub? And if you sub for sub, let me know what you think about it. Let me know your your views on sub for sub. Because me personally, I don't do sub for sub. That's not the right way to get your, you get your subscribers and to gain loyal fans. And those who really love and enjoy your videos day by day. 
I'm just being real with you guys, you know? And one more thing I want to say, like I had some crazy folks come at me and was like, yo, do you sell your YouTube channel? How much can I buy it for? Yo, can I buy your YouTube channel? What? What? What is, what is this? What, what, what are you guys doing YouTube for? To get money out of it? Really? To get subscribers? Because that's all you worried about, really? Don't. People, do what you do with YouTube and love it. Everything else will work itself out. That's all I'm gonna say. If you're on YouTube for the wrong reasons, it'll show. And some of y'all are out there putting yourselves out there in the spotlight. In the lights. In the lights. Don't do it. Keep doing what you do with love. Doing what you do with your boy Matt. AMTV. Make sure you guys give that video a thumbs up. Well, I don't know why I put the two pieces up. But give it a thumbs up. And be sure to subscribe if you enjoyed the video. It's your boy Matt for AMTV. Comedy. We do comedy. We do vlogs. We do gaming. We do it all. Be sure to share the videos out, man. I know I'm tongue twisted. Love y'all. It's your boy Matt from AMTV. Peace.